Hello everybody, how are you doing? In this video, I'll be talking about Canadian job vacancies in different provinces. Now, this will be a statistical analysis and I will be talking about the trends of 2017 and especially the first quarter of 2018. So, if you're interested, stay tuned. Hello guys, this is Shitanshu from Dream Abroad. If you want to immigrate to Canada or Australia without paying hefty fee to the consultants, Please visit my channel, I've got many videos and many more are coming soon for you. Also if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please subscribe. As I told you in uh, this video, I'll be telling you about the uh, statistical analysis of the jobs of uh, in Canada in the first quarter of 2018. Uh, if you want to know, know how to find the jobs and which are the uh, top 10 job sectors, their salaries, I made uh, separate videos for that. Uh, you can go to my channel and you can see this video 10 ways to find jobs in Canada uh, from your home country and uh, another video this one top 10 in-demand jobs with their salaries in Canada in 2018 so these two uh, these two videos will be very helpful to you I'll provide the link uh, to this video to these videos in the description box below Okay, let me tell you that all the details and statistics shared in this video are strictly based on the report published by Statistics Canada in their official website www.statcan.gc.ca. This is the same government organization which does the census of the population of Canada. So it is very trustworthy and the reports will be accurate. Now this report was released on 12th of July 2018 and it was for the first quarter of this year. Have a look at this chart and I will explain the details to you in a little while. The number of job vacancies totaled up to uh, around 462,000 by the end of first quarter out of which around 75,000 job vacancies were contributed only in the first quarter of this year. In the first quarter of 2017 it was around 57,795 to be exact and in the first quarter of 2018 74,775 job vacancies were added to the list. So, uh, which means that there's around 19% rise in the total number of job vacancies. The job vacancy rate rose 0.4% to 2.9% and it has been continuing uh, the series of year over year increases in the number of job vacancies. So, which is a good, good news for the people who are thinking of migrating to Canada. So, moving on, uh, this let's just talk about the job vacancies in different provinces now. So, the largest increase in job vacancies was in the state in the provinces of uh, Quebec and British Columbia. In Quebec, the percentage rise calculated from the first quarter of 2017 was 37.3 in this quarter of uh, 2018, the first quarter of 2018, and in the British Columbia, it was 35.7%, uh, in Ontario 57 in Alberta 185 and in Manitoba, it was 26.4% rise. Now, uh, talking of the numbers, in Quebec, around 25,000 uh, job vacancies were created, in British Columbia, around 24,000, in Ontario, around 10,000, in Alberta, 8,000, and in Manitoba, around 2,800 job vacancies were uh, were created in the first quarter. Now, uh, this was just the top five that I've talked about. Now, let's talk about the job vacancies in different sectors. So, the job vacancies uh, rise in almost all of the largest industrial sectors, actually 9 out of 10. So, in the healthcare and social assistance, you can see 11,000 uh, jobs were added. In the transportation and warehousing, around 9,000 jobs were added. In the manufacturing sector, around 7,800 jobs were added. So, uh, in the accommodation sector, around 8,000. So, the list is like that. You can have a look at it. I, I'm sure that you're not interested in each and every sector. You should, you'll be interested in only your own sector. So, you sh should just uh, see that, you know, if there's any enough scope in your sector. So, uh, there's a widespread increase in job vacancies across broad occupational categories. So, if I talk of uh, the trades, transport and Equipment operators, there's a rise of you know 22,000 job vacancies in that sector. If I talk of the sales and service, there was a rise of uh, 21,000 uh, job vacancies. In this, uh, then you know the list goes on. So 
many people actually ask me, you know, what is the scope of uh, sales jobs? Many what is the scope of, you know, uh, technical jobs? So you can have a look at, at this list over here. And this video was created just to give you an idea of uh, the job vacancies. Obviously, I haven't posted any job vacancy in particular in this video that I told in starting that this is just the statistical analysis. And uh, here by this, through this video, I just got, wanted to communicate, you know, to all of the guys who are willing to immigrate to Canada that there's a lot of scope and, you know, the job vacancies are on the rise. So if you have the enough talent, the uh, if you have the necessary requirements, if you can fulfill the necessary requirements of the employers, you'll definitely find a job. Thanks for watching. If you have any queries or doubts, please comment in the comment section below. I would also love to hear the feedback from you. Please like and share this video and subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. Thank you.